Hey there, 2020 graduates. Um, we want to give some information on how we will uh, proceed tomorrow once you arrive on campus. Uh, number one, I have my mask. Uh, that is very important. Tomorrow when you get here, you will enter through the main high school entrance to the parking lot. You will be flighted and you have that information in several different areas. You'll have different flight times that you'll come in, but each flight will have a parking area. So for me, I was valedictorian. Not really. I, I was like number nine in my graduating class. But for the purpose of this, I'm in flight one. Inside my car. When I'm inside, I do not have to have my mask on. But your guest and you will put your mask on whenever you exit your vehicle. For the purposes of this video, I'm not gonna have it on though. Um, you must bring your own mask. You will not be provided a mask. And also highly suggested that you and your guests all arrive in the same vehicle because we only have limited parking again. So four guests and the graduate, after you're out, you will hear your name called. Uh, we'll, we'll make it loud enough uh, through the use of a bullhorn, microphone, or something, but you're gonna hear your name. When you hear your name, that is when you exit your vehicle. Then we're gonna proceed over this. We're gonna have two or three tents over here. We're gonna have a spot set up for medical check-in. At that spot, you will have, number one, you'll have your mask on, but at that spot, we'll have a couple of school nurses here. They're gonna make sure that you have an appropriate temperature and they have a questionnaire for you to fill out as well. And then we will keep that on file. Then the second tent, 12, 15 away, 15 feet away from the first tent. Second tent is gonna be the check-in area. There'll be graduation committee uh, employees sitting here and they will, number one, give your guests programs for graduation. Uh, number two, they're gonna give stickers. And those stickers mean that you have been approved through the medical tent and it is you and your four guests. Once you have those stickers and it's an appropriate time, you're gonna come see me at the on deck tent, which will be at the back of the fine arts building. Now, once you are here, we are waiting on the graduate in front of you to see Mr. Graham, get the diploma or the red book. You'll learn later, you don't actually get your diploma until we leave campus. But once you enter these doors, I will have information given to you on what's expected once you proceed through the doors. So let's talk about it. The graduate and guests will enter through the back door of the Fine Arts Center. They will come along here. At this point, the graduate will go to the stage to give Mr. Graham their name card. All guests will go down the stairs. Guests will go down the stairs, enter through this doorway. They will be allowed to come along and stand in front of the stage to take pictures. So they will be able to stop here, see their graduate, take pictures of them receiving their diploma. So once you have your card, Mr. Graham will be ready for us at the podium. So I'm gonna walk across the stage. I will give you my card. Thank you, sir. Christopher D. George. And hopefully your four guests will take pictures of you. They can clap for you. But at this point, Mr. Gaunt and Mr. Shannon Davis, school board president, they will be waiting one of them with one of these fancy red books. Now, this red book, again, does not have your diploma in it. You will get that as we exit campus. So, Mr. Terry Smith, a professional photographer, he will be over here as well. He'll take your picture. At this point, you can have your mask off as you're coming across the stage here. He takes our picture. You take your red book, and we exit the stage, and you put your mask back on. At this point, your family members, they will proceed up an aisle to the lobby area. Graduates are gonna come down the steps, 
and don't hit any of our things here in the hallway, like Mona Lisa up on the picture. But you're going to proceed <laughs> up the hallway to the lobby, which is going to be our exit point. You go. Follow, guests will follow the exit sign along the walkway. Once you exit the Fine Arts Center to the lobby, you will follow this exit sign out the main doors towards the parking lot. As you enter the lobby, we would like for you to exit the doors as quickly as possible so that we can bring the next graduate and family in. All right, graduate and guests will exit the building. Graduates will come in front of this red wall and we will have a cap throwing station. We will want you to move your tassel. You'll be videoed and then you will get to take your cap and throw it in the air and don't throw it on top of the building. Or she's going to have to go get it. After the cat throw, you will get into your vehicle with your entire guest and yourself. You will drive toward the high school front office to meet Miss Tina and Miss Little to get the graduation packet. Miss Tina and Miss Little will be available here. Hey, Miss Tina, how's it going? What's your name? Bobby Joe Stinson. Bobby Joe Stinson. Oh, here he comes with the diploma. Here you go, Bobby Joe. Congratulations. Thank you. That is your actual diploma. It is the only one you will ever receive from us in your life. Do not remit, do not forget that. I because will. Because in 20 years, when you call back and say, I need my diploma, we don't have it. So you're saying you're going to print me another one? Absolutely not. One copy, that's the one. So it's like a birth certificate, but no reprints. That is correct. No reprints. All right, graduates, you're almost there. 2020, the year of the mask, coronavirus. You were the group that we told to go home early. Then we wouldn't let you go completely. This is the day you've been waiting for, though. Graduation day, 2020. Congratulations, yep. seniors. We had fun. It was awesome. Chris George is awesome. <laughs>